Yo, hello, it's Revy here and in today's video I will be showing you guys how to color grade in After Effects. And if you guys want to support me, I have a website where I have some editing packs which could make your editing easier and better. But yeah, let's get uh, right into this tutorial here. So the first thing we're going to do here is to import in our footage we want to use for this color grading here. And I'm going to be using this footage here from a website called pixels.com but yeah we're going to color grade this uh, footage basically so we're going to be starting by making a adjustment layer so you're going to press ctrl alt y and here we're going to start by adding a effect called curves and here we're going to just increase the contrast a little bit here uh, so you're going to make a point right here and you're going to drag this uh, point here uh, up to something like this here and you're going to make a point here and drag it down here to make a, a s and you can adjust these two points here to the color grading look you, you guys like something like that i think this looks good and uh, this is the difference here just think you increases the contrast a little bit here and after that we're going to be adding a effect called lumetri color and here you're going to open up basic correction okay so i'm going to start off by increasing the temperature here to 10 and then i'm going to go down to whites and set it to 35 and then blacks and set it to minus 35 and after that i'm going to close this basic correction down and open up color wheels and here i want to drag the mid-tone to a yellowish color here just to get a little bit more warm feeling in the coloring here and for the highlights here i want to make the sky more blue because it's almost gray so I'm gonna drag this one down all the way to here and it should look something like this. And for shadows I want to make it a little bit more warmer. So this depends on what kind of color grading you want. I'm going for a more warmer look here. So I'm going to focus more on the like red yellow colors. Rather if you would go for a colder you would of course go for a more more blue, more, more green, green, cyan type of colors. But I think this looks pretty good. So you're going to close this down. And now we're just going to be adding an extra effect here. You might not, not need this effect. But for this footage, footage here, if you zoom in a little bit, you can see uh, it has some pixels here. Or like bad quality, I guess. And to get rid of that, we want to add a effect called Remove Grain. So we just want to make the whole footage more clean. So you're going to change the viewing mode to Final Output. And then go to Noise uh, Reduction Settings. And for noise reduction settings, set it to 10. And there you go. You can see all the pixels here just disappeared, which made the footage a lot more cleaner here. So that was nice. And now we're also going to be adding sharpen here to make our footage more uh, crispy or like high quality, I guess. Uh, so I'm going to set the sharpen amount to 75. And you can see it brings out some highlights here in uh, her hair. Uh, and I think it looks pretty pretty good and after that we're going to be adding vignette and I think this is a little bit too strong uh, vignette for me so I'm going to turn the amount down to 75 and then decrease the angle of view to 32.5 and as I showed you guys before you don't need to add a like separate vignette effect you can just do it in a lumi lumetri color here uh, vignette and then adjust here but i'm already used to use this effect so that's why i'm using it this is what it looks now it looks very very good in my opinion and now when we add the sharpen you get these edges here it kind of makes a bright line on the edges here so how to get rid of, rid of that is just to add transform and then scale it up to 101 percent so you get something like this here and i think it looks pretty pretty good of course the settings might depend on the footage you're using and what uh, kind of look you guys want but now you guys have no which effects you could use uh, to get a more cleaner color grading look for your footage so this is the difference here pretty pretty satisfied with it if you guys enjoyed this tutorial please like and subscribe and if you guys have any new ideas on tutorials i can make please comment that down below don't forget to check out my website, check out my socials, join my Discord server, and I will see you guys soon. Take care, and have a nice day.